Rồi, bây giờ mình chuẩn bị xem nha. Đây bắt đầu nè. 1 2 3. More flying fish to come. But first, let's get there to the Mekong Delta, Gung Te, a place I've been a few times, but never to the island that's home of the flying fish, Galop Bay. But first, chị cho em một cái uh, cái bánh lỗ tai heo ha, cái bịch bánh tráng gì đó, cái đó bánh tráng gì? Ờ, à, quấn quấn đó phải không? À. Ok, cho em một bịch luôn. Ngon không? Ok, lấy luôn luôn. Ủa phan phan chị, cái cái đó là cái gì? Cái đó là gì? Yeah, I only do road trips mostly for the car snacks. Hmm. Hmm. There's many famous eateries along the way to the Mekong Delta. Usually there's many cars and vans parked in the front. And at this place, Wenkum Kimfu. I mean, it's easy to miss the signs, but you can't miss the smell of pork ribs being grilled over charcoal, smoke billowing into the streets, making travelers drool. Lunchtime is especially chaotic, crowded, and delicious. Today, I'm with Fizzy Beer, a Swiss musician who was visiting Vietnam for the first time, and with Anthony, an Australian who has been to Vietnam a few times, and he's the most Viet Q looking guy I know. Anthony is so stereotypical Viet Q. When people look at him, they tell right away he's Viet Q. Look at this. White shoes, shorts, a shirt that has very uh, short... Uh, Short sleeve. Uh, short sleeve. Yeah, People yeah, in yeah. Europe, they dream about this. My friend Nina has to grow her own bean sprouts. And those are some skinny bean sprouts, Nina. Wow. This is a family style lunch where various main dishes are eaten alongside some veggies, a soup, and of course, white rice. Everyone shares. This is what my mother would make if she made food like this. Dip it into some tamarind sauce. It's like an eel. Kind of like an eel. Oh man, that's the bones. I just swallowed the bones. Make sure you chew it really well. I uh, nook soon. Let's try some of those ribs right here. Mmm. Mmm. Wow. My God. That flavor. It's so smoky, right? No. Nah. And how can a gum yudin be complete without gan chua or sour soup? It seems easy enough, but trust me, to get the right amount of sweet and sour, it's not easy at all. And this place nailed it spot on. This is actually our fourth country together in the last two months. From Switzerland to Slovenia to France to here in Vietnam. Who would have guessed, right? The first time you met me, right? In a little train station, right? Who would have guessed that we'll end up in Vietnam together like this? Okay, okay. We're right next to a road, so it's a little bit dusty. But I don't know if it's smoky from the pork being grilled. Looks beautiful, by the way. Or is it dust? I don't know. I'm inhaling both. Mm. Oh man, my first coconut in Vietnam in over two years. Woo! Drinking the coconut reminds me of my mom because whenever I'm in Vietnam, she doesn't say, hey, have a nice trip or stay safe or anything like that. She always says, hey, make sure you drink the coconut, okay? Because they're cheap. After getting a bit lost, we boarded a boat not knowing really what to expect. We're heading to an island called Gong Sung and I've never even heard of it until this very moment. <laughs> and that was our guide, Kang. He is a native of this island, one of around 300 or so residents, and he's currently studying tourism at the university. <laughs> our first stop is a floating fish farm right in the river that raises some local and not so local varieties. Wow. Oh. Wow. Oh. oh my god. Cái này á do là nuôi một cái mật độ rất là dày đặc nên là mỗi lần em cho nó ăn á nó sẽ va chạm vào nhau. Nó tạo thành những cái tiếng vỗ tay clap 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 như vậy. Wow, all of it. Wow. Oh, 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 oh. Wow, wow. 
có đổi màu được luôn wow. Nếu như nhiệt độ trong nước á Tầm khoảng là 30 độ C trở lên Nó biến thành màu đỏ cam wow. Lúc đó người ta gọi nó là con cá chơi đỏ Wow yeah. Oh, Archer fish Yes Oh, wow Oh my god, I can't believe it. I've never seen that before. Nó ngậm nước vào trong miệng, cái khoang miệng nó có một cái cấu tạo rất là đặc biệt. This place is awesome. Oh, oh. Oh my god. Oh my god. Con này thuộc top những cái loại cá oh mà sống mọi độc lạ nhất thế giới. Wow. Oh. Phía xung quanh nó xác định được cái vị trí rơi của con giấy, nhưng mà nó lao tới cùng một lúc luôn. Bây wow. giờ làm lại nha. Làm lại một lần nữa. Wow. They can estimate where the 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 cricket will fall. Yeah. Okay. Wow. Incredible. Incredible. The shata. Put both feet in there. Put put both feet in there. It's mesmerizing. It's so beautiful, so mesmerizing. Cái này lần đầu anh Minh anh Minh sướng nha. Lần đầu tiên sướng. Lần đầu tiên được sướng nha. I was quite enthusiastic about this place because you guys know I love aquarium fish and to see them being raised in such a natural environment outdoors is a real special treat for me. They even sell koi fish by the kilos here and being outside was really peaceful and it's going to get even better. Oh my god, this is so cool. Wow. Wow. Holy moly! Wow! 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 Oh, look at this guy. He's gonna go down. Yeah, they call it a monkey bridge. Okay, so uh, there's two types of. Oh, come on. There's two types of uh, longin here. This is uh, the, the 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 bigger one is from Vietnam, and the uh, smaller ones from Thailand. So they they admitted to me that they don't grow the smaller ones here. They actually buy them in. But curious to try. Uh, either or. Mm. Mm. The Vietnamese one is bigger, the meat is smaller, but it's more sweet than the Thai one. Mm. It's so sweet. The Vietnamese one is so sweet, but the seed is so big. Mm. I want to eat more, man. It's looking good. Wow, that one. <cười> à, măng, à, bamboo shoot Nó lớn lên chút xíu coi này Mình chặt lên mình luộc ra một nước à, Rồi nó ra nước nắng bỏ rồi Mình để ráo cho mình kho thịt Hoặc là à, yeah, em à, heo. bamboo shoot yeah, yeah, Đặc yeah, biệt okay. là phụ nữ phụ nữ mới tranh đẻ đó à, Hầm măng với bóng heo à. Ăn sữa ra nhiều lắm Sữa ra nhiều con bú à. Cho ăn này luôn cũng sữa à, nhiều rồi mình bú luôn à, bú mà, Anh chuyên môn bú mà <cười> Wow <cười> Wow, đẹp quá. Ủa như là nếu mà muốn hái là phải leo lên vậy. Stop shaking! I'm scared. From. I have no health insurance. <laughs> I'm American. That's why. Nhưng mà này sao cô biết là nào nó xong? À, mình nhìn cái gì phía ngoài á? Okay. Okay. There you go. And then roll. How you roll it, man? How you roll it? Attention. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, he knows how to roll. Cái này nếu như mình làm chậm quá thì nó cái bột bánh nó sẽ bị giòn. Ah, you gotta do it fast. If you do too slow, then it gets crispy. Okay, fail. Wow, fail. fail. <laughs> this is the main event. This is why I wanted to come here. Everything else has been a bonus. Here we go. Okay. Uh, <laughs> starting. Free, miễn phí, muối ớt, 
mua ớt uh, miễn phí free. Thank you. So each place that you go, it's an entry ticket. So each person is like 20,000, 30,000, 40,000 depending on the place. And at the end, they add it up and then you pay. That's basically how it works. And you pay the guide which is 200,000 and each person is 90,000 for the boat. And then each entry is different, right? I just ordered something very special called exploding popcorn and it costs 100,000 dong, which is about $4 and we get to bring it home. Oh, okay. <cười> trước khi mà mình tập cho nó bay lên đều bay lên đồng loạt mình tập từ nhỏ phân ra hai công đoạn để tập thứ nhất là mình phải gõ nha bởi vì cái tập tính của con cá này nè là nó sống ở đầm lầy dùng đầm lầy thành thử ra mình phải gõ vào ban ngày mình phải gõ như vậy để cho mình giống như mình báo hiệu là đến giờ ăn vậy đó và cách thứ hai nữa là cách mình quăng thức ăn nha còn nhỏ thì mình quăng thấp từ từ lớn lên mình quăng cao lên ừ. thì suốt quá trình mình tập như vậy là mất khoảng 4 tháng rồi đến lúc đó nó sẽ trở thành phản xạ có điều kiện nó nghe đúng cái âm thanh đúng cách quăng thức ăn nó sẽ bay lên đồng loạt nó đáp nha nếu như mà từ 4 tháng trở lên đó mà mình không có cái động tác với nó mình hút thức ăn của nó mình quăng xuống nó sợ lắm một hai ba rồi vô cái ông dữ này một hai ba Wow! Oh my God! Oh my God! Wow! 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 Yeah. Hi, come on, come on, Jude. Thank you. And everyone wants a picture with fizzy beer. You could feel really far away from home here on this island, but at the same time, I felt very much at home. Does that make any sense? There were no tourists out there when we were out there. This felt very untouched and definitely worth a visit if you're already in Gangte. So come here before the tourists all come, and when the fish are still flying. Yeah. Bye, Emya. Yeah. Bye. Yeah. Bye. Yeah. Bye. Yeah. The frog is good, but what I, I hate, I hate seeing the frog finger. It reminds me that, oh, it's actually a frog. Ooh, look at that. Ooh. Wow, this is so good. The apple snail, there's some sugar in it, some black pepper. Wow, so much flavor. They, they do a really good job here. The apple snail is actually phenomenal. Mm. These are just the warm-up dishes. This is not the main event. This is the main event. Duck cooked with fermented tofu. Yet no chow, which is this right here. So it's basically the broth is this, the fermented tofu. And you have a uh, taro. Taro in there. Thank you, thank you, Anthony. You have taro. You have a uh, duck, of course, and you have duck blood, which is what I'm looking forward to, of course. That's the duck blood right there. Mmm, I want a piece of that. I love duck blood. And of course, the dip is you dip it into more fermented tofu. Yay! Wow, it smells like a duck for sure. <laughs> Have you already smelled a duck? Wow. How is it so sweet? Maybe it's the broth? Let me try the broth. I think this is definitely the best no chow I've ever had. The, the best duck and fermented tofu. Rice field rat. Rat fried in fish sauce. Okay, take a bite. Oh my God. That is the best meat. Rat meat is simply the best meat. I'm serious about it, guys. Okay, maybe I'm recording that. Mm.
Rat meat is simply the best meat on this planet. And I haven't eaten every kind of meat, but all the meat that I've eaten, rat is the most flavorful, the most juiciest, the most sweetest. Mm. Oh look, the liver, the organs still attach. Mm. Wow, mm. amazing. Mm. Rat liver. Nobody wants to try a rat? I kind of hesitate. Anthony, you don't want to try a rat? Uh, maybe after this, uh, this one. No, never. Ever since the last time I had rat, which is probably four or five years ago or something, and the only time, the first time, people always ask me, so what's your favorite food? What's your favorite kind of dish? And I've always said, rat. That's it for this video. Please give it a thumbs up and leave me a comment down below. I've been Kyle, that was Fizzy Beard, Anthony, and Min. Goodbye for now, and I'll see you in the next Vietnam video.